Hi guys, welcome back to another video. I've actually, I'm doing a makeup or well, eyeshadow a collection video of palettes and singles and quads and everything in between um, and also declutter. I've actually already started filming it and I realized my ring light wasn't on so I am starting over. So, um, yeah. So let's go through the palettes that I've already said that I'm going to declutter. Um, this is the e.l.f. Uh, made for matte, matte, made for matte um, eyeshadow palette. I'm de decluttering this. Um, this is the Prism eyeshadow in Naked. Um, I like these shadows, but I have these colors in other palettes. Um, can you see that? Um, and I'm decluttering the Elf Need It Nudes. Super pretty. I love it, but I think I have these shades in other palettes. Also getting rid of um, Walking on Red Carpet. This is, was a limited edition from Wet n Wild that I haven't even opened yet. Um, another limited edition, There is a Party um, that I'm getting rid of. The Maybelline Spruited Seas I'm getting rid of. I actually used to have two of these and I got rid of one already. I don't know why I had to, um, but I'm going to declutter that. And then I was going to declutter this Physician's Formula 1, but to be honest, I think I want to keep it. Well, I mean, yeah, I think I want to keep it. it the shadows, so... Um, it's just glitter. It's pressed glitter, really. Um, and it, I think they make a really good eye topper. So I'm going to actually keep it. And then I have this Carity one um, that I have not really used yet. I do love this color in the middle, but I, I really haven't used it. So um, I don't have anything else from this brand. That's where, where I'm torn. Um, but I really don't, I only see myself using maybe these three middle colors. Um, I'm going to say maybe on this one. If I don't have this color in another palette, then I'm going to keep it. If I do, I'll pass it on. So this is going to be a maybe. Um, I'm passing on this All May um, Trio that I maybe use once or twice. And this Fergie one, Wet n Wild Fergie, which just looks super gorgeous, to be honest, guys. Like, I love the color story on it, but I haven't used it. So those are all going. And then, so I have three Urban Decay palettes. I don't know if these are real, to be honest, guys. I do use them, and I've never had any issues with them. I bought these on Wish um, a long time ago. I no longer buy makeup on Wish, but um, yeah. Um, I don't think these are real, to be honest, guys. I mean, the quality of the eyeshadows are actually really good. I have the Naked 3 on my eyes today. Um, but I cannot pass those along if they're not real, you know, or if I'm not sure. The other ones I'm keeping, this is um, the Wet n Wild Not A Basic Peach Palette. This is the only Tim Tam palette that I have from them, so I'm going to keep it. Um, I also am keeping Flirting at the After Party. A lot of purples in here. I don't know if I have a ton of purple eyeshadows. I have two LA Color ones. Sunflower and Orchid. I am keeping those. And I am keeping this Maybelline Eye Studio in Pink Persuasion. Um, I have two Anastasia Beverly Hills. I have the Modern Renaissance and the Artist Palette. I don't know. I know this one. Is, I got this off a of wish. I don't know if it's real. I have used it a bunch and the quality is pretty good. I don't remember where I got this from. Um, I have not used it a ton. And because I don't know what's, if it's real, I'm not going to 
mess at all. Like, if I want to get rid of it, I'll just throw it, in, throw it away, to be honest. Um, I have these standing my campground from Wet n Wild and Thrift Store Chic, both limited edition. Decided to keep those. I have this one for Mary Kay's Mary Kay at Play. I don't know. There's no name on it. Gorgeous colors, especially for the holidays coming up. Um, I have one from Cargo. I bought this at um, Kohl's, I believe. I haven't used it a ton. Um, but those are the shades. I still have the plastic on. I think I do want to try to use this. Um, yeah. It's gotten through so many of my de declutters. I've decluttered um, quite a few times already, but I just never filmed them. So this time I am fil filming them, and I think I'm filming them because I... Um, I love watching declutters. Uh, that's what I've been obsessed, obsessed with lately. So I have this Physicians Formula Butter Eyeshadow in Tropical Days. This is pretty new to my collection. Well, I think I got it a year ago, to be honest. Um, I'm keeping it. I have all three Lorac Pro palettes. These I bought with my own money. Um, this one was when Lorac was still sold at Sephora. Love this palette to death. Um, I plan on doing a project pan or products I want to use up video, and this is going to be one of them because this is um, I've had this um, palette for so long and I would like to use it up. I although I probably repurchase it after I use it up. And then I, I don't know which one is the second or third one because it doesn't say, but I have this one. Um, I love I haven't used this one as much, but I'm going to keep it. I'm not getting rid of any of my pro palettes at all. Never, ever. Um, I just love the formula. And I have this one. Um, I haven't used this one too much either, but yeah. Um, definitely going to use. I need to start using those too, so. Um, Oh, found another Elf Prism eyeshadow. Oh no, I, this is a side in. Okay. Um, I'm keeping this one. Sorry, I got confused. I thought it was the one I didn't know about, but I did know about it. And then I have the Party Ready one. Um, going to keep that. I just um, like that there's some, some options of color in, in here, so I'm going to keep that. Um, Keeping the Beach Cosmetics, it's Judy Time palette, even though I haven't gotten much use out of it. Um, there are purples in here um, that I love, and this one might be similar to the Carrie one. Um, no, it's not. Alright, so... I have the L'Oreal La Palette Nude 1. I have the two, I think I've already decluttered that. Um, I've used it a couple times. I do like the formula. Um, don't, uh, I think I'm going to keep it. Alright, um, full Smashbox, full exposure. This is not real at all. I'm pretty sure. Um, let me see. I could work with it. I'm going to keep it because if I decide I'm not using it, I'm going to throw it away. So anything I got on Wish that I don't want to keep, I'm going to just toss it throw in the trash. Um, this one was in my BoxyCharm and that would, video just went up. Um, of course, I'm going to keep this. I haven't even used it because I just got it. So, um, And I have nothing else from this brand. Um, oh, this is the Mark Dream Sequence, so this is from Avon, but it's their Mark line. Um, these are, I thought this was super pretty. Super buttery and pigmented. Yeah, I'm keeping this. 
white peach palette. This is real. I got this on Mercari um, Keeping. It's pretty new to my collection. Aurora from Alter Ego. This is pretty new to my collection. Keeping it. She Glam. This was for my um, Shein Makeup First Impressions, which will be up soon. Um, well, I'll be able already by the time I edit and upload this video, but um, I'm going to keep this a little longer and play with it. Beauty Bakery. That's in my um, BoxyCharm. I'm going to keep that. My um, I have the Coffee Break with Danny Metamorphosis. Um, the, the Super Shock Shadows keeping, and I have the Kathleen Lights one keeping it. Love these. Love the Super Shock formula. Have the BH Cosmetics Fairy Lights. This is new to my collection. Um, I'm keeping it, and I don't know if you guys can see what you guys can see. Um. Oh. Okay, the light just went off. Back. Alright guys. Um oh, I have Laura Lee Sleigh Bill Press Pigment Palette. Um yep. I do want her nudie, nudie patootie palette, to be honest. Um, I haven't even opened this yet. This is new to my collection. It looks super pretty. I'm going to keep this. Let's throw it away. Um, I have this big old smash box thing that it was a gift. Um, so it has like... Like color correctors and bronzers, um, which I never will never use. And it has eyeshadows and blushes. I've used a little bit. I think I'm gonna I'm gonna pass this along. It is too big and too clunky, and I will never really use it. Although I appreciate it, it's a gift from my cousin. Um, but it's not my cup of tea. This one. However, even though it's big, the packaging is so beautiful. It's by Tarte, and it opens, um, and then, um, yeah, smells like candy. I will, yeah, I've used a, a little bit, um, and these are all things I would use. I don't like the Lights Camera Lashes, or I didn't, so I retry it, um, but yeah. So, I wonder if there's a way... I just wish the packaging wasn't so big, um, but I love it. it. Smells amazing, so I'm keeping that. I am going to declutter this. This is from Mary Kay, a limited edition one, and by um, a collab with Patricia Binaldi. I love these shades right here. These eyeshadow shades, love them. We'll never use these cream products right here, so I'm going to pass it along. Um, I also have my Mary Kay compacts right here. It has some Mary Kay shades and blushes I'm going to keep. Um, this is the Immerse palette um, by AUA Beauty that I got on Shop Miss A. This is pretty new to my collection. Um, it's very interesting. I think I used it once. That blue. Um, okay, so the quality isn't that great. It doesn't swatch that great. I think I'm gonna pass it. Um, yeah, that's gonna go. I have the two Lorac Mega. I got the Lorac Mega Pro Mega Pro Two. I got these off of Wish. I love these, even though if they're not real. I used this one for my wedding, um, and I just love these shades. Um, you know, the quality is actually pretty good for not being real. And like I said, I haven't had any issues with them. 
And then I got this Jouer uh, Mandric in the Making Ultra Foil, Ultra Foil Eyeshadow Palette gift set. So um, I I got a Sephora gift card as a gift um, from my cousin, and then I bought this with that gift card. These are gorgeous, and this it comes with the topper. I am definitely keeping this. This is beautiful. Um, yeah. So I think that's all for my palettes. Um, oh boy, that's a mess. Um, so I'm gonna get into the singles. Um, I have this single. This is Jessie's Girl single. I don't think I've, it's a baked eyeshadow, mineralized baked powder eyeshadow in the shade Plum Forest. I've never used it. I might, I'm going to pass it on. Um, this is the Mink Hikari Cosmetics Cream Pigment, Pigment in Mink. Um, I'm going to keep that. This is the Clarins. Um, mono reflex soft shimmer eye color and relent off burn. Um, I'm gonna pass that along. I have lots of Milani ones here. Um, these are the Milani Bella eyes. Um, I'm going to keep all of them, even though I haven't even used all of, a lot of them. But I just like having them. They would just make me happy. Yep, yep, yep. These these would be great toppers. Um Yeah, so I have several of them. So I have the um one in Bella Chiffon, which is like a off white kind of thing. Bella White. Bella Champagne, this is Bella Taupe, Bella Copper, Bella Espresso. Alright, um, full Smashbox, full exposure. This is not real at all. I'm pretty sure. Um, let's see. I could work with it. I'm gonna keep it because if I decide I'm not using it, I'm gonna throw it away. So anything I got on Wish that I don't want to keep, I'm gonna just toss it throw it in the trash. Um, this one was in my boxy charm, and that would video just went up. Um, of course, I'm gonna keep this. I haven't even used it because I just got it. So, um, and I have nothing else from this brand. Um, oh, this is the Mark Dream Sequence, so this is from Avon, but it's their Mark line. Um, these are, I thought this was super pretty. Super buttery and pigmented. Yeah, I'm keeping this. White Peach Palette. This is real, I got this on Mercari, um, keeping. It's pretty new to my collection. Aurora from Alter Ego, this is pretty new to my collection, keeping it. She Glam, this was for my um, Shein makeup first impressions, which will be up soon. Um, will be up already by the time I edit and upload this video, but um, I'm gonna keep this a long, longer and play with it. Beauty Bakery, that's in my um, BoxyCharm, I'm going to keep that. My, um, I have the Coffee Break with Danny, Metamorphosis, um, the, the Super Shock Shadows, keeping. And I have the Kathleen Lights one, keeping it. Love these, love the Super Shock formula. I have the BH Cosmetics Fairy Lights. This is new to my collection. Um, I'm keeping it, and I don't 
know if you guys can see what you guys can see. Um, oh, okay. The light just went off. Guys, um, oh, I have Laura Lee Sleigh Bell Press Pigment Palette. Um, yeah. I do want her Nudie, nudie Patootie Palette, to be honest. Um, I haven't even opened this yet. This is new to my collection. It looks super pretty. I'm going to keep this. It's the other way. Um, I have this big old Smashbox thing that it was a gift. Um, so it has like like color correctors and bronzers, um, which I never will never use. And it has eyeshadows and blushes. I've used a little bit. I think I'm not, I'm gonna pass this along. It is too big and too funky, and I will never really use it. Although I appreciate it as a gift from my cousin, um, but it's not my cup of tea. This one, however, I, even though it's big, the packaging is so beautiful. It's by Tarte, and it opens, um, and then, um, yeah smells like candy I will yeah I've used a, a little bit um and these are all things I would use I don't like the lights camera lashes or I didn't so you try it um but yeah so I wonder if there's a way I just wish the packaging wasn't so big um but I love it, it smells amazing so I'm keeping that um, I am going to declutter this. This is from Mary Kay, a limited edition one and by um, a collab with Patricia Binaldi. I love these shades right here. These eyeshadow shades, love them. We'll never use these cream products right here, so I'm going to pass it along. Um, I also have my Mary Kay compacts right here. It has some Mary Kay shades and blushes I'm going to keep. Um, this is the Immerse palette, um, by AUA Beauty that I got on Shop Miss A. This is pretty new to my collection. Um, it's very interesting. I think I used it once. That blue. Um, okay. So the quality isn't that great. It doesn't swatch that great. I think I'm going to pass it. Um, yeah, that's going to go. I have the two Lorac Mega... I got the Lorac Mega Pro, Mega Pro 2. I got these off of Wish. I love these, even though if they're not real. I used this one for my wedding. Um, and I just love these shades um you know the quality is actually pretty good for not being real and like I said I haven't had any issues with them and then I got this Jouer uh, Maverick in the Making Ultra Foil Ultra Foil Eyeshadow Palette gift set so um I I got a Sephora gift card as a gift um, around my cousin, and then I bought this with that gift card. These are gorgeous, and this it comes with the topper. I am definitely keeping this. This is beautiful. Um, yeah. So I think that's all for my palettes. Um. Oh boy, that's a mess. Um. So I'm gonna get into the singles. Um, I have this single. This is Jessie's Girl single. I don't think I've. It's a baked eyeshadow, mineralized baked powder eyeshadow, in the shade Plum Forest. I've never used it. I'm. I'm gonna pass it on. 
And this is the Mink Hikari Cosmetics Cream Pigment Pigment in Mink. Um, I may keep that. This is the Clarins um, Mono Reflex Soft Shimmer Eye Color and Relent Off Burn. Um, I'm gonna pass that along. I have lots of Milan ones here. Um, these are the Milani Bella eyes. Um, I'm going to keep all of them, even though I haven't even used all of, a lot of them. But I just like having them. They would just make me happy. Yeah. Yep, yep, yep. These these would be great toppers. Um. So I have several of them. So I have the um, one in Bella Chiffon, which is like a off-white kind of thing. Bella White, Bella Champagne. This is Bella Taupe, Bella Copper. Bella Espresso and Bella, Bella Emerald. Um, oh, I think I have another one too. Um, yeah, Bella Mandarin. Oh, another one. Bella Sky. Um, I don't know if I have all of them or not, but I'm keeping all of those. Um, is the Stila and the Shell. Um, I'm going to keep, well, why? Why am I keeping it? You know, um, I don't have very many Stila shadows, but you know what? This is a good all over shadow. I'm going to keep it. Um, I have the Bobbi Brown Essentials eyeshadow in Petal. Um, this is a, um, let's go ahead and keep it. I have another one by Bobbi Brown. This is in rose gold. I'm going to keep this too. Uh, uh oh, it just fell out and broke. So that's going in the trash. Um, all right, that takes care of that. I got another super, super shock shadow and Lala keeping elf um, press mineral eyeshadow. Um, I think I have other ones. I do have other ones. I don't use these, um, to be honest. I'm pretty sure they're good. That one's broken. Um, I'm gonna pass these on. I don't use them. Um, this is Avon Cosmetic Bronze Fantasy. Looks really pretty, I'm passing it on. Um, this is Laura Geller eyeshadow, I'm keeping that. I have some All May ones right here. Um, I'm gonna keep this one, which is in, I don't know. These are the Shadow Softies. I'm gonna keep this one, this green one. I'm gonna pass on this purple one and this brown one. So, yep. I have a Pacifica one. I'm gonna keep that. Um, I have this Essence Mega Glam I'm keeping. Um, I have this one from Elle um, that I'm gonna Go ahead and part with. I'm gonna part with this. Um, this is in Celestio Taupe. 
I think at one point I was obsessed with taupe eyeshadow, especially baked taupe eyeshadow. This is the Urban Decay um, Single Shadow and Midnight Rodeo. I'm keeping this. Um, keeping this Essence Mega Metal Glam. Um, oh, this essence. I'm going to get rid of that. Um, I'm keeping this Laura Geller one. And Supernatural Smoke. Keeping this Urban Decay one and Zodiac. Um, I have some L'Oreal Infallible Shadows. This is the Amber Rush Golden Sage. Um, Infinite Sky and Perpetual P Purple. I'm keeping all of those. Um, let's see what else I have in here. A Sephora single, Nutty and Wet and Wild Nutty. I am keeping those. And I have a single Nifer Nomad in Marrakesh or Desert Sand. Marrakesh Desert Sands? I don't know. I'm going to keep that. Um. Elf Baked Eyeshadow, I will pass that on. Um, I have a L'Oreal Shadow in Taffeta I'm keeping. I have this Meat Matte um, Eyeshadow. Uh, it's a dark brown. I honestly used to use it to fill in my eyebrows. I'm keeping that for that purpose. The, another Elf Pressed Mineral Eyeshadow, pass that along. MAC um, eyeshadow and Cha 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 I'm keeping. Um, I have this her car. Did I show this already? Her no, I did. Um, I have the Wet n Wild eyeshadow and Cheeky. I'm keeping that. Okay, these are my NYX ones. I have three NYX shadows that I'm keeping. This is Punk Heart. Tin and Golden Peach. I'm keeping those. I have these smaller cargo ones here um, that I don't know. I'm going to pass these on. Um, this one's yellow. I'm not going to use that. This one is a purple. I might use that. So this is Province. This is Oz. I I will pass that along. Um, this is really not good here. Oh, I have this Mark eyeshadow. Um, it's actually not Mark eyeshadow. It is Mary Kay eyeshadow that I put in here. I'm keeping that little thing. And this Glamour X has also um, little tiny um, eyeshadows from Yabby. Um, I'll just keep it. I don't know. Um, sorry, I got more. I have this o Ofra one. I'll just put it in one of those Z palettes. I think it's a du duplicate, to be honest. <sighs> Makeup Forever Artist Shadow. I don't know the shade in this. Um, I'm just gonna pass that on. Um, I don't know what this is. Um, what brand that is, to be honest. I'll keep it, I like the color. Laura Geller, um, I'm not going to use that, I'm passing that along. Um, Meat Mount Trimony, that's a pretty purple shade. Um, I'm not going to use it in here though. Um, 
I have Mary Kay um, Rock the Runway um, color strips. I'll keep that. Clinique Little Quad. Um, don't know. I do like the colors in there. I'm going to keep it. I have a couple of Mary Kay ones that are still in the packaging that I'm going to keep. Um, I have this one. Shoot. Can't even open it. Uh, I have this quad. It's by the brand Macurique. I think it's called. Or no, it's a lantern. I think it says lantern. I don't know. Um, I'm gonna keep now. I'm gonna pass it on. I have this YSO one. This is really old. I think it's. You know, I'm gonna keep it still. <laughs> um, I have, oops, there goes the brush. Um, I have this Avon one in shell. I have this one in tr true color. And I have. This one in Orange Crush. Wait, is that it called True Color? Is it called something else? Oh, no, no, this is the other one with Gold Goddess. This is Orange Crush. I'm going to keep all of these. I, I do kind of enjoy them. I, actually, no, I don't, can't say that. This is a Stay Lauder. Um quad that I have used. I'm going to keep and continue to use it. Um, what else do I have? Mia Be Beliza um, that I'm going to keep. Um, next I have uh, I have a lot of other eyeshadows. I'm going to do cream eyeshadows and liquid eyeshadows in a different video because this is too long but yeah so I'm not getting rid of a whole lot um to be honest um but yeah that's just how it is um <laughs> yeah and then uh, you know I might change my mind about some of the singles too because I don't use all singles a lot but we'll see but that's that is my collection eyeshadow collection um and kind of declutter video yeah so see you guys next time bye